So Trina and I are literally, it's my hand, setting up the tripod. It's literally just arrived. We have, I'm literally catching a train down to Dublin in two hours. Megan has an hour lunch break. Yeah. Um, and that's the time we have to film <laughs> this. And currently we're trying to set up the ring light. Like, of course, we've like wanted to do a YouTube channel for so long. And then we just never, like we had all Christmas. We had so much time, like, I've had COVID being in isolation. Trindy's had COVID being in isolation. We had so much time to do this. And now when like my work feels like it's quite busy and Trindy's going leaving. back down to Dublin to do like her last semester of uni, we're like, this is a perfect time to do it. To begin. But you know what? Like if you don't start now, you'll never start. So we're trying to assemble this. I might turn this camera on guys, just so we can see what the height looks like. If you guys can see our reel, okay? Okay, so we've managed to assemble the ring light. Uh, oh. not on the volume thing, so yeah. Thank you! There we go! Hello, this is our third time. Oh my gosh, we literally just like sat and chatted there for like 25 minutes and it didn't even record God. like it just went off and then it wasn't on the camera Trin did say to me last night she was like make sure you've got enough storage on your phone because we're doing it from my mobile maybe my we'll mobile, do like my iphone maybe we'll do like little chunks and then we can pause it and then okay that's check. a shot that was definitely working yeah but basically we are setting up our own channel and it's called the, the sister, sister files yeah the, the whole concept behind it is like it's supposed to be a place where you check in and it's going to be like you know those sisterly conversations just, that you yeah. either have with like your older, younger sister, or if you don't your have best sisters, friend. you have them with your best friend. Yeah. Um, and it's just gonna be somewhere where you check in. We're gonna be talking anything like it's like an agony aunt, but it's actually someone who's on your level, like the same age as you. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's just like somewhere you can jump on. Like we obviously, we're like we're not gonna say like we're, we're sisters. Like we yeah. literally like are best friends one moment and then pull each other's hair out the next. Yeah. But it's just somewhere where. You guys can come and we're just going to chat about everything from relationships, kind of like friendships, French, holidays, and like boy travel, lifestyle, fashion, yeah. just like anything random. So it's like the sister files, like there's going to hopefully be like something for like every single eventuality. But yeah. we're starting like our first video with just like a wee bit of a haul. Trinity has just come back from a ski trip. I'm going on a ski trip to see my best friends live with my other two best friends and um we were like ski trips are really expensive aren't they yeah so like this is what we were kind of discussing like all over christmas is like yeah. christmas is such an expensive time of the year as it is and both of us because obviously we've all been locked down in covid we were like okay as soon as like the college said that okay there's a ski trip happening i was like i want to be on that i don't care yeah. um and it is so expensive like we were saying yeah. when you actually took total up like flights flights are always extortionate because everyone's going at the same time you have to get your ski pass yeah. transfers accommodation equipment like and everything so me and megan were both having like alcohol in the airport like literally like, it all it just so adds many little things. and it's also because like the reason we wanted to do a ski hall specifically is because the ski what you are skiing is usually not your essential stuff like no. there's so you'll many pull it out like expenses. once in like a blue moon and then maybe but in like five years time when you eventually get going again it's like out of fashion so we're trying to like talk about stuff that we I are sharing a wardrobe going skiing. Yeah, we're not even like exactly the same height or no. anything. Like, there's we literally got the same salad heads. Megan is like five foot what? Five foot seven. I think. Seven. I'm five foot four. Like <laughs> Megan Don't is we look like, like it in the camera though. I, like we look. Yeah, like I'm actually I'm actually quite tall in this. Okay, so we basically just wanted to get a haul together of some yeah. essential. They're not necessarily essential. So like all of your essentials for skiing would obviously be like. Ski socks, thermals, boots, the practical boots, stuff, the, the boring skis, stuff. the helmet, just like hundred percent helmet. And, you need that. Yeah. <laughs> um, these are just like the added extras, and anything like this is stuff that we would wear day to day as well. Yeah. So you can get the benefit out of this whilst you're on holiday. Yeah. And whilst you're like back at home. Trindy's gonna try on some of the stuff, like just a couple. Yeah, of Yeah, I think some things to see. It's so good to be. Yeah, it can look nice on a hanger, but just to kind of give you like the height of Trin, the height of me, and like how it can work. And then hopefully I'm going to get actual pictures. Yeah, Trini was too photos. busy, like 
I got a few Partying it up to get, she said her hands were too cold to get her phone out to get photos. No, so. it was freezing on the slip, I wasn't getting any yeah. scenic pictures. Um, so I am going to get one um, when I'm away. Sorry friends, you're going to have to take all these photos and um, just we'll, we'll put like wee snippets in. I think yeah, at the end we'll maybe add some edit. stuff in, but you'll yeah. be able to get a good idea just from seeing the items. So, so we're gonna let's get started. Okay, so I think it makes most sense to start with the ski jacket. Yeah, yeah. let's pull her out. So we got one from one of our favourite brands, Sisters and Seekers. Now, I know so a this, lot of you are probably thinking, that's this is not, not a ski, ski brand, brand. And it's not. Our mum literally was like, girls, you're gonna be freezing. Like, get a good, sensible jacket. Yeah, maybe it's just good to like finalise at the start. This is not a practical haul. This is not like... Although, you are a first-hand example that you were very warm and some of the days you said... Yes, but like all of these items, I, every single day, I wore thermal leggings, yeah. thermals on like my top. Very like, boring, practical, trespass, thermals. Yeah, literally it was from but trespass, from like no, to decathlon, decathlon or trespass, like that's yeah. where you go to get all those basics. Or TK Maxx, if you've got yeah. a TK Maxx, but yeah. sometimes it's hit and miss. Yeah, you can kind of go when there's nothing, there's actually nothing whenever I went. Yeah. But um, sometimes I, you can go and get like a wee bargain, you can get like a nice brand yeah. and stuff. I tried to get a cheap ski jacket there, couldn't get one. So this one I think is £89 from Sisters and Sisters. So much that? Um, maybe I got it reduced a bit, but I'm pretty sure. Do we have a wee, um, should we put it on a wee hanger? Or do you yeah. want to try it on? Yeah, I can try it on. So this here, one... You got a really good wind guard protection as well with this. So it's, it's like kind of like two jackets. When you go on and look at it on the website, like they yeah. style it so kind of like retro. It's so cool. classy looking. I'm trying to and get that up there. I also got so much wear out of it. Should I put in a pair of ski goggles just to show the look? Okay, okay, we're going. We're jumping straight <laughs> into the ski goggles. These, they are block ski goggles. I think they're in and around like yeah. anything between like seventy five and hundred. I think those ones yeah. were eighty. Okay, so okay, look, Megan's insisting and trying them on. Like, usually these would be around a helmet, so obviously they They're a bit baggy at the back. Go so close, let's see them up close. So they these are actually here. so cool on. Like, the colour is so good. You can get them in, like, pink, It's red, just because I wanted to yellow. try them on because you can get ugly ones, which are fortune. Yeah. And, like, these here ones, Trim's had for, They're like, completely, years. like, reflective. So whenever you get, like, photos and stuff in the mountains, it's so cool. Like, you can't see anything. And we're thinking all black outfit, and then you just have, like, yeah. these like blue um shades so they're perfect. block okay so we've done the jacket should we try on a hair bandage yeah so, so this will go underneath both of these i got on asos so we have one that's Columbia. using trendy shouldn't discount always and then one of them is just like the asos what's their brand like they're i think it's is just it asos like design or something yeah i think so asos design so we'll put there we go there we go we got them done too i've got all my hair out trindy's got hers in behind the ears now this one's really good because it's got the wee oh, sunglasses should I take bits. Out? oh yeah so you can actually put oh how do you do that so oh you there's little slips where you can put your sunglasses in do you want to grab a pair of sunglasses we'll give it a go another pair of asos i don't know i don't what think it i'm is. selling this headband i think you should pull all your hair out okay let's go again um I love a cheap pair of sunnies only because I lose them all the time. In fairness, when you go skiing, you literally like, well, if you're anything like us, you're falling all about the place. So any sunglasses you have. Or if you've got them in your backpack, they would be, the glass yeah. would be smashed probably You would need to be bringing the case up. How does that look? Is that any better? Yeah, I really like that of all the hair out. Cute. Do you want to do a side profile? You look like the Mona Lisa when she has that headband on. Is there a photo of that? I don't know. That's not the actual thing. Oh no, she's not wearing a ski hairband, she's just got a hairband. That her. is, oh yes, I actually get what you mean. Yes. Let's just try this on quickly. So I feel like this is how they styled it on the Sisters and Seekers website. And sunglasses. They had the, um, yeah, they had I a headband sunglasses. on. I think these were literally eight point, but I love them. I just love the colour of them. Should and I as I said, I love a colourful shade. So where are they from? These are ASOS, so how much were they? Do you remember? Eight pound, I'm pretty sure they were. Eight pound. So we're going yeah. like, we're giving you guys everything in between. I got these gorgeous sunglasses for my 21st birthday from my two besties, Sophie and Julia. Um, they're a Prada pair, but like, you can get just so classic. many like them. You, get, you, can, you can get really similar ones on ASOS, but like, I feel like when I wear these, I do feel luxurious. Trendy is I just always know. kind of in the sun. So like, I feel like for you, that is an investment. Where but that people... style, I'm sorry, that style. That will stay in. Yeah. That, that'll like, that'll not, never die. When you're like die. a grandma, you can still wear that. 
but like so you can you don't lose them if you're you up won't partying lose them. Is this definitely what they're for this these splits are for maybe it's for your airpods oh my god that would make more sense I don't think okay because they're maybe a bit too low down they must be for but the anyway good thing we don't get paid for any of this because i'm describing it all wrong i'm sorry no one's gonna buy any of these items <laughs> Okay, so we just did a kind of random detour. We were just kind of pitching and grabbing random things. <laughs> like, you know, like a child on Christmas morning, you're just looking for the gifts of your new mom. Like, yeah, we'll take this and this next. So it's a bit chaotic. But like, we'll go through, like, these are like the main items. So like, I feel, Megan, you got this also from Sisters and so Stickers. this was like one of my main Christmas presents. Ah, I so really, cute. really, really like this. And I thought it's such like a winter sort of thing you could wear or you could wear a cute wee pair of like running shorts like, oh, in the yes. summer and like, like little salt, trainers, like little dad trainers. trainers. Um, or even like those New Balance that are so into the green New Balance that look so nice again. Yes, yes. But like definitely so, that. Even I think though, this is so easy. I'm going to wear this here. Oh, with like a polar neck, either like a high neck black polar neck. Oh cute, yeah. Or like a creamy coloured polar neck. And then I'm thinking skinny salopettes. Yeah. And then what we both agreed on was whenever you're at Atbury, obviously everything's about like layers, layers, layers. layers yeah. So ideally you would have like your thermal layer on underneath. And Tight fit and thermal. Yeah. And then when I was away, I put on this little white, this is actually a bodysuit, but you don't need to get a bodysuit. This is a bodysuit from Boohoo. And bodysuit. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and over like any of the bodysuits, we always love to put a little graphic t-shirt. Yeah. You know, like for the upright. Yeah. Just to kind of break it up a bit. Yeah, no, absolutely. It makes us maybe a bit more exciting. Yeah, because we've got like black salad pets, black, yeah. obviously this is a black t-shirt, but like, oh, this is, black so this is the black one. I've got this wee one. This is actually a boys one from ASOS. They do them reduced, like so cheap on ASOS. Like yeah. this is the guy section. Yeah. And I love it. And, but and see, that oversized the thing is, fit is nice. Yeah. Then you can fit as many layers you want underneath. Yeah, absolutely. And also, I love these sort of t-shirts. Like I would wear this again, like tucked into a pair of like baggy jeans or like overs. Or pair, like in summer, like a pair of like denim Levi shorts. Yeah, or, or cycling bombers. shorts. Or, a cycling or a pair shorts. of cycling shorts, yeah. And this as well, I'm going to pair it with like a black polar neck or like a black like sport three quarter zip underneath and my... Polar. And like all of these like polar necks and things, like they're on or they're, they're on ASOS, Boohoo, Pretty Little Thing. Actually, if you go into Zara, yeah. my two friends, it's such nice ones. Yes, Shana, yeah like a luminous green which would look so nice underneath like a black t-shirt yeah a luminous green um high turtleneck yeah. or a luminous pink it was so nice oh i, I just like love a pop of color quality. especially if you're going all black like yeah. an all black ski suit like a pop of color okay <laughs> this is another wee jumper thing yeah we'll this was this also one. asl sale and i feel like just this you still has to be it. tried and tested. We don't know yeah. how practical this is going to be on the slopes. It is a crop top. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little crop ski jacket, but it's only because one of our salopets is like a bib salopet that comes up quite high. Yeah, it's so I don't very need high full length tops. And it's just, I thought it was kind of dressy. I think on ASOS they paired it with a tennis skirt. I could be like wrong season, but it was a top I would wear to the gym over my gym stuff. You know what I mean? Okay, Trinity is trying on these flared salad pets and I'm trying to figure out what's the best way for me to show. This is angle. I think we'll have to actually take it out. Yeah, I'm going to actually take this out. Okay, Trin has tried on these skinny flared salad pets. So these are from ASOS. They're the ASOS like 4505 range. Yeah. And what is, I love about these is this like strap, this scoop neck strap. It's called a bib, isn't it? Oh, is that what it's called? Yeah, it's like a bib. A bib vibe. And it's just, it's extremely flattering. They're so slimming. Yeah. Anytime we ever went skiing, like as like when we were younger, yeah. we've only been a few times, we're like, what were the salad pets like? We had like, literally <laughs> like, what's that guy, the, te the big... Michelin man. Michelin man. That yeah. is literally what we look like coming down the slopes. And now I feel like everyone, it's like these skinny salivettes are just yeah. like a vibe. Yeah. Skinny salivettes, big fat chunky moon boots. Like <laughs> that is like the combination. So these actually are kind of flared. Do you want to push it down a little bit? Yeah. So like, sorry, excuse my feet. But like they're slightly flared. So they will go over the boot rather than tuck in. Yeah. But it's kind of nice because it makes like, I feel like it makes the thigh look super, super slim with that yeah. flare. These are super comfy, super thick. 
I was able to fit a layer underneath them, yeah. like really cozy. It's called dance month. Yeah, <laughs> and then <laughs> this is just an example of like wearing a little hula neck underneath it. I really like And that. having something like a pop of colour. Yeah. So like, like I said with the Zara ones, the pinks, the greens, like we have a blue one, like anything like that, just to give a pop of colour so that you're not all yeah. black. Yeah. I'm just gonna try on these here. These here are like, do you know what they remind me of? It's like a riding jumper. Yeah. Like, and they're really nice. So they're super skinny. So they've got a wee zip up the sides. And they're really warm. So they've actually got, what are these here things called? A stirrup? Yeah. Is it? And um, look at me go with all this terminology. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, horsey girl? Horsey girl. I don't even, I don't ride horses or anything. But yeah, these here she's gonna try on. These are very, very flattering. Okay. okay, these here I think are my favourites. Yeah, they're. Oh, you actually put a bit of belt in them. There's space for belt. But these are them. Maybe if I stand and cut against the light, you can see them better. Yeah, my pancake bum. Um, <laughs> yeah, these are the exact same brand, ASOS4505. We'll try to get some photos of Megan in these at her trip. Yeah, I'm going to get photos of both of these here um, on me. And do you know what's so funny? So when I was like looking through salad pets and stuff, Trim was like, oh, I don't like that ASOS 4505 make. Yeah, I just Why? don't usually like this big sticker. Because, so to be honest, I actually feel like the quality of these salad pets, they could be any brand. Yeah. Like, they could genuinely be any brand at all. Yeah. And, like, there's nothing wrong with ASOS. Everything we buy is literally from ASOS. Yeah. But, like, these could be one of the top, like, these, these could be Helly Hansen, any of, like, the yeah. top. Betty Rides or Betty something. Betty Rides. You would not know with the quality. So yeah. I'm just like, that's why I was like, but they, it's so obvious, obviously, with the 4505. But I actually didn't even realise. Like, whenever I put on my jacket, it actually, yeah. it's quite oversized anyway. And also, Trindy want to do, like, a full look for you. She also has, so Trindy got these little moon boots. Oh, yeah, this is what's so nice about these self heads is because they're so skinny at the bottom, they're not flared. <laughs> okay, we're definitely still getting to grips with how to use this tripod. But because they aren't flared you can tuck them into the ski boot or into your snow boot or whatever you're wearing like to afro afterwards i feel like it's always nice to change for something yeah but anyway ski boots or like snow boots so these here are the ones that i brought away they're moon boots um i got them like two years ago yeah and they are so warm definitely worth investing in um you got them as a present i think yeah i got them as a present for christmas um and I just feel like you need to have practical shoes when you're away. Like yeah. you obviously ski in your ski boots, but they're so uncomfortable. Like, I don't know, like however long you spend in ski boots, your feet and your shins are aching by the yeah. end of the day. So for like- Trainers later, where you'll literally go like- Oh, trainers will literally just be over, like, sort of wet, tits. literally yeah. um, by the end of the day. So definitely worth investing in a pair of Snow boots, Megan. You're bringing you're bringing your doctor Morgan. I'm just gonna like I don't have lots of room because I'm sharing a suitcase with one of my best friends. So I'm literally just gonna bring um my doctor Martins. I think and wear them the whole time, which I think is like grand because or they are walk, really like, durable. Like and yeah. they're they are waterproof. Like they're good. Even, like mountain quality. Boots, I feel like you could, or like Timberlands or something. Oh yeah, yeah, really yeah. Good. Like anything like that. But definitely, I definitely recommend getting a pair of snow boots. Also, the moon boots specifically have just been popping off not necessarily this style big but you know ones. the big chunky ones i would love a pair so much okay so we're now going to go on to headwear so this here was another one of my christmas presents and trinity copied me so yeah yeah megan asked for this for christmas and then i bought this one <laughs> literally a day before my ski trip well it arrived like a day before my ski trip because i liked it so much i think this these colors really sum us up i am such a pink girl megan everything <laughs> every other thing that she wears is pink a and then i just like minimalist. basic colors yeah. neutrals so these are you look like you're about to burgle the house you look like the back she kind of do i feel like this is fashionable <laughs> It's like camouflage. <laughs> the make is Fiorucci, but I know Fiorucci is actually quite expensive. But it's also popping off at the moment. Popping off, you keep it is though. <laughs> like I keep seeing it everywhere. Yeah, but these I actually got reduced on the website. Yeah, so they were 30, was it 30 pounds on yes. the website? And then you get like a 15% joining um, like discount. Yeah. So I think it works out as like 25. Yeah. Like roughly whenever Not you too have too bad. The, that was including um postage and packaging. 
Yeah. And see, to be honest, I will be wearing this when I go down to uni. Like, I'm wearing this to the train station to go back down to Dublin. Like, this is like such a good quality. Winter warmer type essential thing. Yeah. Like, you I, 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 so I wear this while walking our like little dog. So, like, I love this. Like, yeah. I'm not saving this for skiing. Like, this is going to be warm, like, for the next so five much. autumn winters. <laughs> yeah. And I literally felt like this was perfect for going underneath my helmet. Like, it kept me so warm and cozy. Yeah. Other Ooh. little hats and things. So, like, this one. So it actually took this oh my away gosh. with This her. is literally my favourite one. I feel like it's, it is not even an expensive make. I think we got this from TK Maxx. Yeah, my mum got it for, from me from TK Maxx. Like, TK Maxx is actually brilliant for little small things and like... The make is hell in her. No, you try it on. Your hair looks nice and curly. But like, Thanks, it's... Love. It's obviously like faux fur, but it looks so dressy when you have it on. Yeah. Like, it's so like... I think it's fun for opera, especially when you're going somewhere kind of fancy you could yeah. not tell that like how much this here was or anything no like, you know what i mean if you thought it was in like a really bougie or expensive like french brand or you know yeah you wouldn't know make, you genuinely wouldn't know also like yeah. all of these hats are so handy because you get helmet hair like your hair is going to be like completely skew with, with. it's going to be yeah. greasy like you're going to be not. tired you're not going to be bothered about like washing it mm. or like even blow drying it straightening it so see, any hats like this, they're literally perfect. That's why we have like 10 of oh, them in this haul. Talking of hats, can we try on like some different little... What about this hat? This is our favourite so one. So before we carry on, maybe this is a bit much with my... Le um, so this is my reversible, it can go leopard black print. or leopard print. And again, ASOS. <laughs> ASOS literally like the go-to for all this. This was like here, this is quite tight on my head. Really? And this is we got a uh, we got a large in this. No, this we? is actually the men's. This is not a man's one. Yeah. Again, we will try best to link it. I love that. I this literally love that. Carol Baskin vibes. Yes. We're giving <laughs> off a lot of Carol Baskin vibes right now. Yeah. Shout out to Carol. Pretty black. Like I love that. I feel like, like that's that so one. wearable. And even down in uni, mm. I would wear that. Yeah. You're going for like pints with your friends outside. Yeah, it's so cozy. Like in fairness, the quality is so, is, it, is good. Yeah. Would have been good when like it was like outdoor restrictions and you. Yeah, to, everything like, was outdoor. outdoor but this is up. like this is a brilliant hat for like going to the club, stuff it in your coat pocket, and then if you're ever out chatting in the smoking area, yeah, put this on. Yeah. Do you know what I mean or waiting in the queue to get into the club? Yeah, so the cozy. <laughs> Next up, these are literally like a fun little throw it in the basket if you see it in the asos this is like our mum's from ages ago she's definitely or i think our mum had this when she was our age she like... had like a little mac that like a mac jacket and this went with it it's so yeah. cute i feel like it's nice and like that like, yeah i think push so. it back like that i feel like these are really in like lots of big brands are starting to do these bucket hats but thank god we found this sweet archive of mums because like Otherwise, I feel like it's just fun at Afro to have like a few like different random bits to so be got, wearing. Like, these here hats, we've got like the wee beanies, we've got the like fluffy one. Where's this one from? Do you remember? Oh, is that me? Ah, that remember sorry. we we actually bought we bought this in the um the airport terminal. It is that in like, London. I it, it it doesn't have a, a label on it. It's something with sisters in it. No, it's it's not. It's, it's not, not pink soda or something. Oh my word! It's something pink lemonade or something like that. I can't remember the. We'll try and find. We'll that. try and find it. But like, it's just a random bucket hat. I feel like it's because. Do you not feel like Afra is kind of like the snow version of like festival wear? Yeah. Do you know it's like the snow festival wear? So if you just have like random cute little it's accessories tough. to put on these with your sunglasses. Do you know what I mean? Essential. This is an essential. This if is your intense like, class. You do not need to I did jacket. not chose this, a little something to warm your heart. Yeah, I think that's cute. <laughs> Probably really true when you're actually freezing. But because... Like, you need to have this over your... Well, I'm not going to say helmet because that's a safety issue. Like, you need that over your skis. You need that over your thermals. You need that over your ski jacket. You need to be bringing a hip flask with you. And you need to be sneaking it into Apre. Yeah. It has to be done. I don't know what way. I'm not gonna put this one on because I can't untangle. Oh, I really gone by to wear. Yeah, because I feel like the compulsive urge, whenever you have a backpack, to just fill it with the biggest load of crap. I will take it's everything like, with me. Yeah. Yeah, you will, and you don't want to be lugging this big, bas massive backpack up the mountain. Do you know what yeah. I mean? I think That's I might why. go into like my next meeting with this. A little bum bag. 
<laughs> they'd love that Meg you'd probably get fired <laughs> yeah I know <laughs> what are these called East Pack East Pack bum bags but it's just so handy all you need up the mountain is ski pass foam lip hip balm flask. hip flask yeah. and you're ready, ready to go do you know what I mean you don't need all the extra stuff and then one last essential <laughs> before <laughs> sorry that video cut off again so we're yeah. gonna have to reconsider this but one last essential 100 percent sun cream this is la roche posay it's so good it literally acts as like a primer for your yeah. makeup i've actually really badly struggled with like acne the, in the last few years so i don't know how my voice is there but this is like the only sun cream that it's actually, not oily it's very like matte finish. it's for acne prone skin and stuff so it's very very good and you get as we said earlier like with the sunglasses there's so much sun when you're up the slopes and because yeah. it's reflecting off the snow which is hitting you constantly yeah so 100 percent pack this um, and then I think that's us all basically done. I'm yeah, gonna have to rush. I need to get back to work. Trendy's got to tidy up all the mess in her room, and she promised to make me lunch because yeah, I'm gonna make her a sandwich. All my lunch bring in. But yeah, we I really enjoyed this. Yeah, this is it's fun. This has actually been really good fun. We are going to like drop our wee Instagrams below. Yeah, and we'll try and like tag all the items, like the brands, or even just say where the brands like are where from. they're from. Yeah, because a lot of them, most of them. Some of them are pretty new, but others are like, you can definitely find replacements for. It's just the general concept Set, yeah. that we were kind of trying to get across. But yeah, please um, subscribe. Like and subscribe. Bye. Bye. <laughs>